I'm not going to be guessed twice. Everything that I know about chess tells me that this particular attack must win. Sorry about you, that was a bit quick, but you live and you learn. It is amazing that Chess24 have managed to get Magnus Carlsen to play a banter blitz, with Jan Gustafsson being one of Magnus's seconds. Maybe you could say this was bound to happen at some point. The good thing is Magnus will do this again, as he said at the end of the commentary. Thanks guys, and, uh, and see you later. Thanks for the games, and uh, for all of those who challenged me and didn't get the chance, you will, you will get another chance, so don't worry. In this video, we will go through the best game during Magnus's first banter blitz. His game against Cicero. Let's begin. This was the best game in the first banter blitz, and I'll discuss this quickly with you. D4, D6, G3, Bishop G2, and now E4. This is a good way to play against King's Indian players. They don't like to face D4 and E4. Knight F6, Knight E2, and this is the big difference. The Knight comes to E2. Castle, Castle. Knight C3, rather than C4. Get the knight c3 first, c5, h3, and here it looks like some sort of dragon. If black captures a knight d4, a6, it's a sort of dragon. However, Cicero chose to play b6, bishop e3, bishop b7, and here Magnus had to force the issue. If black is not going to take on d4, white will lock up himself with d5 a6 trying to get some play on the queen side and now g4 ideas of knight g3 then g5 h4 a steady king side attack is building h5 provoking white to go g5 another move was knight g3 and after h4 you might go knight e2 and really what are we saying the h4 pawn is weak you might go bishop g5 bishop takes h4 that might have been another way to play in the game, Magnus played g5, knight e8, f4, knight c7, and now f5. Very committal move, not too sure I would have played it. Just because it allows knight e5, which is a permanent outpost for uh, black. But Magnus has ideas of knight f4 crashing in on h5. b5. Magnus here was saying after knight, instead of knight c7, maybe b5 first is possible. Because after take, take, you can't go knight b5 because bishop b2, but also bishop d5 is working out. Cicero chose to prepare the pawn break with knight c7, f5, b5, take, take, and now knight f4. Planning to cash in on h5, just crashing through. Knight e5, he does it, take, take, queen takes h5. And it looks very strong. Magnus said he's going to go rook f4, rook h4, it's just too dangerous b4, knight e2, helping white, really. The knight now has more options. Knight f4, knight g3. Knight e8, rook f4, planning the swing. And really, it's just so difficult to, to defend, even impossible. And the game ended shortly. Knight g6, what else was possible? Well, I'm not too sure, really. You can't really stop rook h4, so if that's checkmate, then that's it. No point playing f6, you just go g6, queen h7. It's over, man, it's over. Knight g6, take, take. Queen takes g6, rook takes f4, knight takes f4. Knight e6 next, with knight h5 as well. Knight c7, knight h5, queen, queen f8. Oh no, knight e8. But then rook f1, and then the game was over. Planning to go rook f7, and taking on g7, let's say, Black played queen d7, rook f7, and that's it. There's no way to defend. A nice attacking game from Magnus. c4, knight f6, knight c3, c6, e4, d5, e5. Already, Magnus said, white has a good version of the French. Knight d7, d4, e6, knight f3. Really, in a position like this, this pawn should be on c5, but also this pawn should be on c2. In return, this pawn would have been on f4, so it really is a good version of the French. Black's gone wrong. Bishop b4, bishop d3, knight a6, castle, castle. And here is the opening scene to this video. Everything Magnus knows about chess forces him to play the next move. Bishop takes h7, check. King takes knight g5, check. After king g8, queen h5, his opponent just resigned. 
how to have continued cut how to continue the game king g6 but then it's looking too dangerous anyway queen d3 check it's looking too dangerous if king h5 then queen h3 king g6 and queen h7 is checkmate if queen d3 f5 then you can all pass on or maybe just knight e6 the entire position is crumbling anyway you could go knight f8 after or knight f4 the king is just too dangerous so that was a quick win for magnus